Segment three, healthcare. Let me give you a quotation and a fact. The quotation comes from you in Basic Economics. Quote, a long-standing staple of political rhetoric has been the attempt to keep the prices of medical care reasonable or affordable, yet the amount of resources required to supply the things we want are wholly independent of what we are willing to pay. It is completely unreasonable to expect reasonable prices. That's the quotation. Here's the fact. The United States de devotes 17% of its GDP to health care. The next country down in that is Switzerland mm -hmm. at about 11% mm -hmm. of its GDP. So we devote something like 50% more mm -hmm. than the next country down. Now, surely it's not unreasonable <laughs> to suggest that we're just spending too much. The question is, uh, when people are spending their own money, I, I don't know how third parties can say it's too much. Well, ironically, Rahm Emanuel's uh, brother, who's a doctor, uh, has on board for this whole Obamacare thing. But really, he, he, he revealed why Americans spend more. Uh, Americans uh, don't, when they go to a hospital, they are in private or semi-private rooms more often than in countries on government uh, uh, health care. And so instead of being in a ward, uh, you're in your own private or semi-private room. It costs more. Uh, you know, American doctors are more readily available. Uh, there is less waiting time. Uh, some people prefer to pay in money and others in waiting time. Now, when you have a painful disease and the government tells you it's a, there's a six-month waiting list, uh, that you, you're paying in a different way. It doesn't show up in the statistics. But you may, you may not even live the six months, depending on what you have. So we pay seven. We pay more and get more. That's it. That's 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 it. That's all there is to it. That's you, it. You don't want to say, but at the same time, our system is terribly inefficient in various ways. You no, don't... it's not. It's not inefficient for people to buy what they want. It, what's it has to be more complicated than that. <laughs> it, 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 you know, it's what's inefficient is having third parties decide what you need and don't need. As for example, in Sweden, where if they and it's not like an insurance company right. saying they won't pay for it. In Sweden, if they say that you don't need this, you can't pay for it with your own money, because they control the whole system. And so your your choice at that point is to leave Sweden, uh, which if you're very sick may be a little hard to do, right. or to have what you need smuggled into you. Right, Tom. In one of the last conversations I had with our friend Milton Friedman, mm -hmm. I recall his saying he was musing about the future of health care, which, as you know, interested him for yes. five d In fact, there are no new ideas, just proposals by Milton Friedman that haven't gotten around to being enacted yet, I sometimes feel. But Milton said, the situation we have in this country is untenable over the longer term. And he said, broadly speaking, about 50% of American health care is private. Mm. subject to the usual incentives of the private market. But about 50% with Medicare, Medicaid, and so forth, about 50% is effectively socialized, run through the government in one way or another. And Milton said, this is untenable. We will probably either go to a much more socialized system in which we will at least have the virtue of controlling prices. Quality may deteriorate, but prices might hey. be controlled. Or we'll go in the other direction and push more of health care into the market, which would control prices and improve quality. Does that make sense to you, that analysis? Yeah. It's about 50-50, uh, but, but, but it's untenable that we're at I don't it? know why it's untenable. I, it's one of the few times I'm, I, I'm, I'm sure if, if he were here, if he he were here I'm sure he'd, of course he'd say I misstated it. Or, right, yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, when people want something, and, and you know, when, when, I, when, when, I, when I was in the, the hospital last, I had a private room. No doubt that costs more than if I were in a ward, right. particularly as in, as in Britain, you know, where you can be ignored by the nurses. Uh, you know, the w women in, in Britain, uh, one of the scandals is that they are having their babies in the hospitals but not in the, in the delivery room. I mean, they're having their babies in the hallway and the, and the elevators because they're calling for the nurse, and the nurse will get around to it when she feels like it. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. And the baby is not going to wait. Mm -hmm. 